Hi, it's me again. It's about 4.45. We're going to be going to our friends here for the cookout in about 15 or 20 minutes. So I thought I would do a real blog for the day. Vlog, whatever. Um, here comes Heidi. Did you see the door open? Um, I've started finally people. I'm not going on vacation until July 22nd, and I've started. My lists, Arkansas trip, stuff I want to take, other things I want to take, kind of my plan of action, I'm started. I can't help it. I'm. I will. When I went to Germany, I had this notebook here, and I would add things to it all the time. So things I want to remember to take with me, or stuff like that. I'm a nerd. I'm a dorky nerd, and proud. I need to make a flag, so I can just wave it every once, in a while, every once in a while. Um. So yeah, I'm kind of. And today I had an epiphany that I will be going right by where the drive through Savari was that I went to last July with Tillman and Harris and Evie and all the guys. Um, and Evie is Blue-Eyed Lady on here. Um, and Harris is Quantum XL. But, uh, I'll be driving right by that on the way down to Dusty Sheets. So I'm like, I'm so stopping. I'm going to take like a two hour break on that second day of driving and have a zoo time. I want to drive through and see all my old friends, take some new video and pictures right up Buffalo's nose. Yeah. So, um, I'm excited. I have my list over here in another notebook of hotels near Dusty Sheets. And I'm, uh, probably going to end up staying at the Holiday Inn Express because I love them. I tend to stay at Holiday Inn Expresses all the time. I even have the, I even have a card in my wallet somewhere. Um, like a preferred customer's card. And I already know where I'm staying at when I'm over, after I leave Dusty Sheets, I'm going to a family reunion. So I'll meet up with my dad and grandma and cousins and see my aunts and uncles and the whole tribe and um, I'll be staying at a comfort inn over that way because my parents have always stayed there every year for the last several years they've stayed at the same hotel so I'll reserve a room next to theirs and check in there on Friday and Saturday night possibly Sunday night I'm not sure I think I might get on the road on Sunday and start heading back up north. I'm gonna come home a totally different way than I go down. I'm gonna like do a big circle. I'm gonna go down through like Illinois, Missouri, swing down through Arkansas, cut across Arkansas and come back up more through more of Indiana. And I'm doing a big yeah. So taking my time. It'll be a nice trip. I am really looking forward to it. I'm such a dork, I've already thought about getting my suitcase out and setting it out. But I'm going to hold back the urges until about two weeks before my trip. Because y'all, I will pack early. I'm a retard when it comes to trips, man. I want to get packed and ready. <laughs> um... taking my video camera today. I don't know how much video I'll take. We have another storm front coming in. My dad just came in here and had me see what's going on. And we're right on the edge of it to where the point where we don't know if we're going to get hit or not. Mother Nature. Hmm. She has been on the rag, people. She is not happy. Um. The only problem I'm having with my trip right now is my cat. The dog is going with my dad and grandma and my cousin Dale. They're driving the little motor home. And I thought I would ask 
my dad's boyfriend and wife to come check on her while because they only need to come like once or twice while I'm gone but I know they're going to New Jersey and when I saw her the other day I'm like now when are you guys going to New Jersey she's like the last week in July and I'm like damn it that's when I'm going <laughs> so um I'll probably ask my uncle and aunt who live not far from here to just come up and check on her because um, I'm going to leave her a bunch of food and water it's all she needs really She's got a litter box. I'm sure she's not going to be like being left alone for that long, but it'll be her first time alone. Like, long time alone. She entertains herself really well, though. I'll be sitting here on the computer and she'll be like on the floor by my feet, just batting a ball around, and she's got these little pom poms that Lizzie brought her and the dog, and she plays with her things all the time. She loves to put them in her water dish downstairs for some bizarre reason. I'll walk by and there'll be one floating. I'm like, why do you put them in your water dish? Why do you drown them? I don't understand her. Oh! Dusty Sheets, if you're watching this, stop right now. I mean it. I know you probably won't, but I mean it. This is for Sharon and Lizzie and... Sandy and all you guys who hang out with her a lot and stick ham. What does she like that I can take her? Can you PM me? Does she collect anything? Any Mickey Neck she likes? Any treats that she likes? I know she likes banana chips, but I know people have been supplying her with those. Um, I would like to get a gift bag of some sort and I don't quite know what to get. So I need some help in that front. So PM me guys. I know y'all know something. So, alright. I got to go because we're leaving here in a minute. Bye. Have a good Sunday. Happy Father's Day to all you fathers. And, um, happy birthday to my daddy. Again. And Fluttershy. And the man who sold my dad his car. <laughs> the, the guy at Western Chevrolet, he's 10 years younger than my dad today. The guy who sold my dad is in Pala. Okay, yeah, that was just randomness. Bye.